Hey everyone, this is Eric Seaman, General News Reporter with the Wabash Plain Dealer, bringing you tomorrow's headlines. What this is, is a little sneak peek into what you're going to be reading in Tuesday's Plain Dealer. Our lead story is written by my co-reporter, Nick Van Heest. Uh, Bob, uh, Wabash County Sheriff Bob Land spoke at the County Commissioner's meeting today uh, about a recent uh, inspection at the Wabash County Jail. Um, some things passed, while some didn't. Uh, get some more details on that story. And our centerpiece story is written by yours truly. Uh, this is a story about a Wabash man who has lost nearly 300 pounds in the past two years, uh, which caught the attention of TV talk show host Steve Harvey. Um, the show will air this week, uh, 2 p.m. Wednesday on NBC. And our next story, uh, written by myself as well, um, a North Manchester man has had his uh, jury trial date in a, in a child molestation case pushed back into the late summer. Um, and there are also numerous uh, other significant ch changes have occurred in that case as well. And then our last front page story is written by our uh, managing editor, Joe Slation. Uh, there's a new exhibit featuring a local man's carved circus models. Um, that exhibit has uh, opened at the Wabash County Historical Museum. Switching over to sports, we have two stories by our sports editor, Justin Shockey, uh, the first of which is on indoor soccer. Um, it's a story on the local YMCA Youth Indoor Soccer League and comments. Uh, and they'll also have comments from the program director on why he enjoys running the game and what the kids get out of the experience. Also, Justin wrote a story uh, highlighting the different youth sports activities the YMCA will be offering this spring and summer. Uh, that will include comments from the senior program director on why those opening uh, sports experiences are important to local athletes in the county. That's all for today. To check out more about these stories, you can pick up your Tuesday Plain Dealer or you can go online at www.wabashplaindealer.com. Until next time, you stay classic, Wabash County.